Hey founders, oh cryptocurrencies are so harmful to the environment. Oh I heard mining farms consume as much electricity per year as Argentina. Oh cryptocurrencies are going to be banned because they're unsustainable. Have you heard any of these statements? These are just myths about cryptocurrencies and their impact on the environment. In this video we'll break them down and debunk them, or maybe we'll confirm them, who knows. Myth number one, all cryptocurrencies destroy nature. This misconception originated with Bitcoin, which relies on the proof-of-work POW algorithm, a classic mining system. And yes, POW mining does consume massive amounts of energy, which is harmful to the environment. However, is Bitcoin the only cryptocurrency? Ethereum, for example, has already transitioned to proof-of-stake POS, an eco-friendly alternative to mining that requires minimal energy consumption. The modern crypto industry recognizes both the harm and inefficiency of POW, which is why assuming all cryptocurrencies Cryptocurrencies are unsustainable is a huge mistake. Myth number two, if cryptocurrencies aren't truly harmful, they're at least useless for the environment. Not at all. Let me remind you that cryptocurrencies were created as a response to people's need for transparent and secure finance. And what is the key issue with various funds, especially charitable ones, that has repeatedly come up worldwide? It's difficult to track where donated money actually goes and how it is used. This is where blockchain technology, the foundation of cryptocurrencies, comes into play. It can make any environmental project fully transparent. Many initiatives are already using blockchain to track carbon credit. Credits. Myth number three, mining farms can't be eco-friendly. Yes, traditional mining does consume a lot of energy, I won't deny that, but energy isn't just electricity, right? More and more mining farms are switching to clean energy sources, where consumption levels don't matter, use as much as you need. Perfect balance. Many regions now allow miners to use solar, wind, or hydro energy, making it possible for farms to operate with zero carbon footprint. So, what do you think? Do you like the idea of crypto ecology? Have solid facts to counter arguments from crypto critics. And that's not even mentioning the growing number of cryptocurrencies that call themselves green and say they were created for the environment. For example, SolarCoin rewards users for generating solar energy, while green credit allows carbon credits to be traded for tokens. Cryptocurrencies are improving every aspect of our lives, including the world around us.